Okay. All right. So Jennifer, um, it has been like for an amazing six months with Anna. I'm like so proud of her and she's She's definitely like one of my favorites and I love working with her, but I just had a few questions for you about kind of what the experience has been like for the confident athlete. So what was it like for Anna before she joined the confident athlete and started working on her mindset and confidence? So before the confident athlete, Anna had been a competitive gymnast and that was an area that her coaches never worked with her on. And so after I, she's not even the same kid. The fact that she goes into and she knows, you know what, I may strike out, but I'm going to die trying. I may miss the catch, but I'm going to run my legs off until I can, can try. Um, she was always determined as an athlete, but she wasn't feeling confident that she could do it. Mm -hmm. And your confident athlete gave her the opportunity to believe in herself more than anyone else could ever have given her that gift. So thank you. That makes me so happy. Um, and we like, Anna has been amazing at communicating and using the tools and resources. So it's been really cool because she's just been so good at sharing like, okay, this isn't working. Okay, I'm struggling here. This is really working. So it's been like such an amazing journey with her, but um, what made you guys choose the confident athlete? I'm sure there might have been some other, maybe some other opportunities or some different things, or just like in general, like making the decision to start to invest in um, like the confidence, the, the stuff, the mental side of the stuff that most people really aren't doing. The reason we chose the confident athlete is because of you, period. <laughs> um, I can very clearly tell you that the critical turning point was her old softball team had hired you maybe for one time or two and then never did anything again with you. However, you started in COVID the daily workouts. Mm -hmm. And from that one time with her old team to the daily workouts, she was completely sold that you were the right person to take her from where she was not confident to where she is completely confident, not perfect, but more confident than she's ever been. Like, so thank okay, you. So good things come out of COVID. <laughs> good Absolutely. Things come out of COVID. <laughs> um, that's awesome. Not many, but that is a fabulous. No, I'm like, okay, so if I would have never done that, I would have never had Anna, which would have been terrible. Like it would have been not the same. So I'm, I'm glad that I had that opportunity to, to have that, that, COVID that I, I called it the C word confidence school. Cause yeah. I was like, try not even to use the word COVID and, and that stuff. But that was like a really, really neat opportunity for me to get to know these girls that joined in on that. Um, so that's really, really cool. Cool. Story. And it paid off Paige, yeah. because those girls really have a, um, I keep the word keep come, keeps coming to my mind is addiction. That's not the right context. It has a bad denotation and connotation, mm -hmm. but the right word is they created a relationship with you mm -hmm. that they hadn't had. And when you have kids who are looking for confidence and they have a young, beautiful, talented mentor, it's not about softball. It's not about whatever other sports you have girls in the confident athlete. It's about who you are and the, and the confidence you exude is almost absorbed by them. Mm -hmm. or osmos by them, whichever word you'd like to use. <laughs> I love that. Uh, so if you knew of another teammate of Anna's or like a friend or family that was struggling with the same things that Anna was struggling with before, and they were thinking about joining the confident athlete or just working on the mental side and the confidence, but were a little bit nervous to make that step, like what would you share with them? What would you tell them? I would tell them three things. One, it's the best use of your money ever. <laughs> Two, don't turn it down. You'll never get the chance again. And three, um, if I'm wrong, I'll pay for your six months. Awesome. I love it. <laughs>